Many of them come off the streets, still others are senior citizens or perhaps disabled. All are looking for something to eat. And for the past three weeks, they found it at the YMCA on Effingham Street in Portsmouth, serving up large helpings of hot mashed potatoes, steaming collard greens, oven-roasted chicken, and sliced bread of five volunteers who prepare the food twice a week. James Kilby stopped by and says the free meal is wonderful. I think it's a wonderful idea for the, for the needy people, but I do not approve it for people that are able to work or got a job. Robert Hardy thinks the kitchen is a great idea. Because so many people out there that are really hungry and uh, don't have don't have eaten eaten uh, don't have places to eat don't have nothing to eat rather. But of course, my, I have something to eat. But it's nice that we all can come. The canned food is donated by the Southeastern Virginia Food Bank, and the meats are purchased with money donated to the program by churches or individuals. Volunteers prepare enough food for about 100 people each day, but they fed more than that when 250 showed up the first day. James Edwards, who started the program, says he attributes the turnout to the kitchen opening near the end of the month. They don't have no money, uh, nothing to eat, and so this sort of thing, it brings more people to, to eat. The soup kitchen is open every Wednesday and Thursday during the hours of 12 noon until 2. In Portsmouth, Ava Hurdle, The Daily News.